Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this quick video, I would like to show you how you can easily hide a channel within Microsoft Teams. Uh, now, in one of my earlier videos I recorded on my channel, I actually showed you how you can archive channels, but this was more of a uh, you know, team owner function. Um, if let's say you have uh, hundreds of channels and um, those channels are never really been used by anyone, you want to freeze the activity, you truly want to archive them, but not delete them. In this particular case, you uh, essentially archive them. The ability to hide a channel is different. Uh, a hide a channel is an individual decision you need to make. Uh, again, here's a use case. Let's say you have a team, lots and lots of uh, you know, channels maybe, maybe some uh, channels you are, you are really more important than the others for you. Uh, so what you can do is pretty much hide the ones you don't need. And uh, this will just be hidden for you, all right? Uh, archive kind of, the ability to archive channel impacts everyone on the team. Hide channels is just your own decision. So how do you uh, hide a channel? Very easy, just click three dots and you choose hide. And um, yeah, it just appears over here. It's kind of hidden, so it doesn't no longer takes any you know uh, you know takes uh, much real estate. Uh, uh, so you can use it for other teams and other you know channels. And you can arc, uh, you can I'm sorry you can hide um, uh, both uh, standard and you know and uh, I guess private and shared channels. I just um, hid the private channel. Let me uh, now hide the shared channel. Uh, just like that. And uh, you can also hide uh, standard channels as well. You can also hide uh, the general channel. So you cannot archive a general channel, uh, but you can hide it. So I'm going to do that. Uh, and uh, so we are down to one channel. And let me actually show you what will happen uh, when you uh, hide that last channel. So uh, this business requirements, this is a standard channel. Uh, that exists on this team. Uh, let me try and hide uh, this particular channel now. Look what happens. Uh, the entire the channel and the entire team were hidden. Why? Because this was the last uh, pretty much uh, channel remaining, and I um, you know I hid it. So there's nothing else. There are no other channels to show. So not only it hid um, the channel, it actually hid the uh, entire you know team. Um, let me go back here under hidden teams and let me uh, restore it. All right, just like that. And yeah, you need. Uh, long story short, you need uh, to have. Um, uh, I guess at least one, uh, you know, channel uh, to make it functional, right? Otherwise, why bother? Uh, so, uh, yeah, I just reinstated this business requirements uh, channel again. Uh, but that's pretty much the functionality. So as you are part of all these different teams and channels, and maybe some channels are no longer that important, just go ahead uh, and hide them. Uh, one last thing I wanted to mention is that the uh, channel notifications, let's say somebody mentions your name or you know, tags you uh, within that channel, um, even if it's hidden, uh, you're still going to be notified, all right? So you're still going to be notified. So uh, hiding it just literally hides it from the view, but it's, uh, you know, uh, you're still going to be notified in case somebody uh, mentions your name in there. Just wanted to mention that. All right, so that's all I wanted to show you in this video. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Goodbye.